Most of us take flying for granted these days, whether for work or pleasure. But for passengers with reduced mobility, flying isn't always easy. Getting on and off the aircraft is a lot easier than in the past, but using the lavatories can be a challenge, especially for wheelchair-bound passengers. On wide-body aircraft, the toilets have already been adapted to their needs, but what is totally new and will really make flying a far more pleasant experience with people with reduced mobility is a whole new cabin design in the single aisle aircraft. This is what the rear of the A320 family aircraft looks like before the design change. On the Airbus A320 family single hour aircraft, we're introducing a new innovative feature called SpaceFlex, uh, where we're basically moving lavatories out of the passenger cabin and reinstalling them into the rear of the aircraft, where we're utilizing space that was never used before. And this creates a lavatory complex uh, that is uh, nice and spacious for passengers with reduced mobility um, and especially useful for those passengers who are wheelchair bound. And Airbus is the first aircraft manufacturer who offers this type of feature on a single hour aircraft. With the new SpaceFlex design, the two toilets are now at the rear. From the outside, you can see on this full-scale model of the back of the A320 the concave shape of the aircraft, which is space that until now has not been used. But with the new configuration, the space is used to create extra room for the lavatories. Quite simply, both toilets can quickly be turned into one larger one with wheelchair access. This is how it works. We have two full-size lavatories adjacent to each other. Lavatory one, and another lavatory here. Now, the two adjacent lavatories are separated by a folding partition, which can be opened up by cabin crew only, folded away, And as you can see, this creates more space, more privacy, and more autonomy for a wheelchair-bound passenger to use the facilities. UK-based Scope is one of the most important charities promoting greater rights for disabled people in both the workplace and their daily lives. For them, the new design shape on the Airbus A320 is clearly a big breakthrough. I think the Space Flex idea on Airbus is really good and it'll certainly it'll make a difference to me because I'll be able to then, you know, use the chair that's on the plane, go to the loo just like everyone else and, you know, it means I'll be able to finally go on those trips that I've always wanted to go on but I've just never been able to before. The great advantage of the A320 family is that thanks to its width, it's not a case of increasing the space of the toilets at the expense of seats in the cabin. With all that extra space now used at the back, up to six extra seats can also be installed along with the facilities for people with reduced mobility. This is a win-win solution for both the passengers and the airlines. We create space for a spacious lavatory, which is extremely useful for passengers with reduced mobility. And we create space for up to six additional seats as illustrated in this aircraft showroom. Thanks to the A320 family, with advantage over its rivals, we can create space and comfort for the passengers and extra revenue potential for the airlines. You know, at the end of the day, um, airliners are losing out um, on not being able to provide for their disabled passengers and that doesn't make any business sense. So I think it's a really, really good, it's a win for everyone, surely. The industry is waking up to the real potential. Already three airlines with a total of 10 aircraft are flying with the SpaceFlex design. And in the coming months, another 525 aircraft flying with 12 more airlines will start operating with that configuration. And it's just the beginning.